Okay, good morning everyone. I hope you have completed your homework before you watch this video. Okay, this is on page 88, page 88 in your textbook. So please check your answers. Okay, question A. In conjunction with Entrepreneurship Day, the pupils of year 6 Arif sells ice cream. The cost price of an ice cream is 60 cents. So Harga cost 60 cents. And the profit to be obtained is 30 cents. Mereka ingin untung 30 cents untuk setiap ice cream. Calculate the sales for 50 ice creams. Okay, so the formula is your cost price, Harga cost, plus your profit, untung, equals your selling price sama dengan harga jualan ok, cost tambah untung sama dengan harga jualan so, the cost price is 60 cents ok, harga cost 60 cents profit profit to be obtained is 30 cents so, mereka ingin Untung 30 sen. So, harga jualan dia berapa? 60 sen plus 30 sen is 90 sen. This is for one ice cream. Okay, untuk sebatang ice cream. Now, question asks you to calculate the sales of 50 ice cream. So, harga jualan untuk 50 ice cream. So, senang saja. 50 times. 90 sen jawapan dia 45 ringgit ok question B Juan Salma sold a house for 420,000 420,000 and earn a profit of 5%. What is the cost price of the house? So, harga jualan dia 420,000 dan ini sudah termasuk profit dia. Untung dia 5%. Okay, remember, the full percentage is always 100%. Okay, harga asal dia 100% dan dia untung 5%. The profit is 5%. So his selling her selling price is 105%. Okay, again, this is the original price. This is the profit. So this is the selling price, harga jualan. So if 105% is 420,000. Okay, soalan bagi tahu di sini. Sold a house for 420,000. What is the cost price? Harga asal dia. Harga cost dia. So, harga cost dia ialah 100%. Lah. Ini yang kita perlu cari. Okay, nampak sini. Harga asal ialah 100%. So, 100 kosong 5 peratus sama dengan 420 ribu. 100 peratus sama dengan berapa? Okay, formula dia. Okay, let me change my pen. Okay, this one you divide this one and then you times 100%. Okay, so 420,000. 420,000. Divide or you put it over 105% and then you times 100%. Okay, 420,000 divide 105% and then you times 100%. Okay, this is 5, so we have to simplify it because the number is very big, number sangat besar, so kita kecilkan. So this is 5, this is 0. Ok, 
okay this is 5 this is 0 or we can divide you can divide with 100% or you can divide with 420,000 it's, uh, it's up to you lah which one you think is better okay um, maybe we divide with 420,000 okay 105 this is 5 this is 0 so 5 and 0 you know that they are in CFA 5 okay mereka da, 5 dan kosong dia berada dalam CFA 5 so kita boleh bagi 5 so 105 bagi 5 ialah 21 420,000 okay 420,000 if you divide 5 you get um, 84,000 okay you get 84,000 so can we do, still further simplify we can right 84,000 is a CFA of 7 because 84 is a CFA of 7 if you still remember 12 times 7 is 84 this is CFA 7 this is also CFA 7 right so this one you can divide 7 you get 3 84 divide 7 is 12 you still have 3 zeros behind so you just add 3 zeros here okay so we make the number uh, smaller okay we make the number smaller so that um, we can calculate later okay this one we can further simplify this one divide 3 is 1 12 divide 3 is 4 and then there are three zeros behind so you just add three zero so now this is one when the bottom number is one that means it's done settled no need to worry anymore because four thousand you divide one you get four thousand so what is remain what remains is four thousand times a hundred okay so this is still rm four thousand you just write four thousand times 100 you just add two zero behind two zeros behind so the final answer is 400,000 okay so this is one way of doing it of course there are a few ways that you can do it okay it depends which one is uh, you're more familiar with okay Question C, the incomplete invoice on the right shows the order made by Encik Fidaus. Calculate the amount to be paid yang perlu dibayar if the supplier gives him a 10% discount. So you have to calculate the invoice first. Okay, kira invoice in dua, quantity 20 per unit 80 ringgit. So total ialah 20 darab 80 ringgit. So yang sport shoes jumlah dia 1,600. Yang kedua 30 unit darab 120 ringgit. 30 unit times 120. You get 3,600. Okay, and then you, and then kamu jumlahkan. Excuse me. Okay, jumlahkan. Six plus six, twelve. One plus one, two, two plus three, five. Okay, this is jumlah bayaran. Tapi ini sebelum discount ya, sebelum discount. Supplier gives him a 10% discount. So, berapa yang dia perlu bayar? Ingat, peratus yang penuh selalunya 100. So, tolak 10% discount, dia hanya perlu bayar 9% sahaja. 90% saja. Okay, you only have to pay 90% only. So, you take the the amount, harga asal 5,200, darab 90%, Letak per 100, okay? Peratus tukar kepecahan. So, top and bottom, you can cross the zero. 
Atas dan bawah boleh potong. Kiri dan kanan bawah boleh potong. Okay, so ini tinggal satu. Tinggal satu, dah selesai. So sekarang 520. Sebab kosong sudah potong ya. Darab 9. So 520 times 9. You get 4,680 ringgit. Remember to write your ringgit RM. Okay, tak ada RM, tiada markup. Okay, soalan terakhir. Kalai reloaded his prepaid card for 50 ringgit. A 6% service tax was charged. What is the total cost of the prepaid card? So, dia beli, dia reload 50 ringgit. Dan dia perlu bayar 6% tax. Okay, you have to pay 6% tax. So, harga asal 100% tambah tax 6% jumlah yang perlu bayar 106%. So, you times 106 letak per 100. Okey. Kosong boleh potong. Yang ini 10. Disan bagi 10. Ni bagi 10 gerak sekali titik di sini. Jadi 10.6 sebab bawah bagi 10, atas pun bagi 10. So gerak satu titik ke kiri. So yang tinggal ialah 5 5 times 10 ringgit 60 sen. This is 10.6. Okay. 5 times 10.6. 10 ringgit 60 sen. Your final answer will be 53 ringgit. Remember to write your RM. Okay. So this is A until D. Okay. Now for your homework today. You continue the other four questions. Sambung empat soalan lagi. Muka surat 88 dalam buku teks. Soalan E, F, G dan H. So today you continue question E, F, G and H. Only four questions. Okay, pause the video and do the questions accordingly. Okay, if you learn something today, hit the like button, subscribe to this channel and share with your friends. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.